hey everyone, just a very quick comparison between plasticity and Xlabs. Yeah, so I'm working here as a practice on this DJI Pocket 3. I don't know, I really love this kind of design. It looks so simple maybe for some of you, but <laughs> you see, you will see it's, it's, it's really almost everything surface modeling. So what I wanted to show you, so here at the top, we have this beautiful transition between like the circle and all of those rectangular shapes, right? And yeah, it's the only way to do the surface modeling. And by the way, guys, do you want like a small course, like, I don't know, like 15, 20, 30 dollars or something where we will model this whole piece as exact as possible with all of the details because it's 95% like intermediate surface modeling. It's definitely not for beginners, but also like not super crazy advanced. So let me know in the comments if you want like complete step by step to add all of the details and like the mechanical parts and all that kind of stuff, because I really, really love this kind of electronics. So what I want to show you is I've prepared here one quarter, right? So everything is already prepared. So it, you don't have to follow along. But if we start uh, and try to patch it with plasticity, the patch just fails. Faces succeeded, but face to face inconsistency has been produced. So I've tried a few different things, but especially if you do like this kind of stuff, so this uh, have been, so, so that have been curves in the beginning and then I extruded, but you see it's, it's, it's not really aligned. So we just need those two edges for the tangency. But if we try to do the same with X nerves, then yeah, it's it's amazing. It's really like the more I use plasticity and play with x -nub, so I always try to do it first with patch because I think you have to learn first how to do it very manual with patch and lofts because if you don't understand the absolute super basics of patching and lofting, <laughs> x -nubs will give you zero benefit, right? Because then you will just mess around with only x -nubs, but you will not understand the mechanics behind the patch and the loft, if that makes sense, right? And obviously, if you want the course, of course, I will do everything with patch and loft so everyone can follow along. And in my opinion, to master patch and loft is one million times more important than master x -nubs. but just as a comparison, because look, guys, we can even give it here everywhere easy, <clears throat> sorry, G1, and we have zero problems. It's, it's really fun, but again, because I've set up everything perfectly. And if you don't know how to work with lofts and patches, you will not get this clean uh, x nubs thing here. And let's even do uh, the same here to the end. Uh, so at the uh, rear, again, I want to patch it, but it's not working. So also, if I join here those sheets here, it's somehow not working. But again, if we try here, <laughs> Xnerbs, uh, it's really fun. And look, like how complicated I think the surface here is. And we can even give you everywhere G2. So I don't want to go honestly into G2 because I didn't optimize it for that. But just let's try and just let's see what we get. And let's just join everything. And yeah, we have here some weird stuff ongoing, so I have to figure that out. But just in general, so if we check it out, it's really, really, really nice. And guys, look, we, we are getting, yeah, I would say basically almost exactly that shape as the pocket thing here. And by the way, if your trial is ending or if you want to upgrade either to the Indie or Studio, you can always save 10% with the discount code Nikita, which you can use at the plasticity checkout page. So yeah, I really like x -nerbs. when just patch doesn't work or would take much more time. So let me know if you want like a small course, step by step for beginners. So for people who have already a little bit of surface modeling experience, everything with patch and loft. So you learn the core fundamentals of plasticity. So x will be just like the cherry on top 
when you work on your personal uh, projects, but I will teach you like the absolute core essentials. So let me know, first link in the description, leave a like and subscribe if you like also this kind of yeah showcase videos. Then see you in the next one, bye.